Hi friends, it's your art teacher, Miss Barnett. Today we'll be creating a playful message. In this lesson, we've been talking about visual symbols, also known as wordless messages. Wordless messages help us communicate visually and not through words. So today we're going to be creating an imaginary fish using, and create a symbol for that. So um, to get us started, let me show you some names of some real fish that you may or may not have heard of. We have candlefish, goatfish, dogfish, guitarfish, sawfish, rabbitfish, roosterfish, torpedo fish, catfish, toadfish, dragonfish, and rockfish. These are all real fish, types of fish. So we're going to use this list as a jumping off place, a starting place for us to come up with some ideas for an imaginary fish. So it could be any kind of combination of an idea and the word fish. So another way to think about this, we're going to think about suffixes for the example, blank less, like we can end words with less. So for example, you could do bottomless, hopeless. So what I would like for you to do is take a couple of minutes, think of the Essex fish, the suffix fish here and add an, uh, another idea that would make a really interesting symbol. So once you've come up with that, we're going to get a piece of paper and a pencil and eraser, and we're going to start sketching our idea. Here All right, guys, so I bro brainstormed an idea. I'm gonna do a chicken fish. So you cannot do a chicken fish. You have to come up with your own idea. So the other things I would like for you to think about, like where's your fish gonna live? Like. For example, where would a rockfish live? Where would a roosterfish live? What does a goatfish look like? So think about what a chickenfish would look like. And how do you think a candlefish would see in the dark? So think about the attributes of the creature and how it's going to contribute to the name to make it a very clear symbol. So I'm gonna make a roosterfish. I'm gonna start by sketching the shape and you can watch, here we go. All right, guys, I've added some details. I've got my basic uh, chicken fish shape down. Now I'm going to add more details and color, and let's get started. All right, friends, here's my completed playful message project. I made a chicken fish. I cannot wait to see what kind of amazing imaginary fish you come up with today and how you create them into symbols. Let's get started. <laughs> 